Hi everybody, so I am hoping to do weekly these lesson plan videos just to give those of you who have little kiddos around Sawyer's age some ideas to do with them. So I'm going to quick go over the two sheets that I have that say what exactly we're going to do on what day and then I will go through our folders for the week and show you exactly what I have planned. So the reason I'm showing this page and if you've seen my homeschool binder video you would have already seen this page but it says what we're doing on each day not specifically but as far as um, subjects what we're doing so Monday is phonics Tuesday is shapes Wednesday is math Thursday is colors and Friday is choice so Friday could be um, something to do with animals um, a craft uh, so it's basically just a fun day um, on the back of here um, also, if you saw that video, you would have seen, I didn't know what I was going to do with this. So I pre-planned the curriculum. So ideally, this is what we would be doing. However, if he ends up going a little bit ahead, I'll just have to shift it around, which is why it's on sticky notes. I can rip one off and redo it. So um, this is how I um, plan for the year. Like I said, this may change based on how quickly or slowly he kind of goes at his own pace. But yeah, so those are those two pages. This is what I refer to weekly so I know exactly what we're doing and what I have to plan. So um, this is the actual week that I have. So I only use about from here to here. Um, once he gets a little bit older and he has actual subjects and stuff like that and something more complicated where he can actually sit for longer, I'll probably use more of this. And then once Lincoln is in preschool, his will start out like this. So... Um, let me quick go through. So here's Monday. Today is phonics and we are doing the letter A this week. So what I do is I write down what we're doing, what activity I have planned, and then after that day what he did um, and how he did. So I can refer back and see how he's improved. So um, Tuesday is shapes. Oh no. Today was the letter A. We did an apple basket sorting for big A and little A. Um, tomorrow is shapes and we're doing a shape match card now just because it says we're doing a shape match card if he's willing to do more um, I'll do more so maybe I'll refer back to the letter a um, Wednesday is math we're doing the number one this week and we're doing a one number one through three puzzle and object counting and I'll show you that um, in a minute Thursday is colors and we're doing the color red uh, and we're doing a color wheel with clips activity and then Friday is choice, and I chose to do a little people animal match. So I'll show you what um, that is as well. So let me quick get out our folders, and I will show you exactly what we're doing. So this is today's exercise on Monday, the um, basket apple sorting. So what we have is a basket with big A, a basket with little A, and then these cutouts. There's eight of each. So what he would have to do is match big A and little a and he did really really good on this um, but this is something we're definitely going to pull out from time to time so tuesdays is shapes we are doing these um matching printables um if i can find the links to all these i will put them down below um this is from modern preschool um and so he has to match the shape person to the shape on the side. He's done these before. He hasn't done them in a while. And he usually has a trouble has trouble with a couple. So those are the ones that I'll write down in the daily um, journal right here. I'll write that um, right there so I can refer back to it and make sure that we touch base on those cards again. So this is um, normally a clothespin sort of activity. So he would clip the clothespins onto here but it's just easier for me to have him either point at it or have a manipulative for him to set on top of the correct answer. Wednesday is this um, counting puzzle sort of thing so we'll have the number three and then um, he can count the birds with me one two three and then also I'll have some sort of manipulative whether it be pom-poms M&M's something that I'll have to put three of them over the birds or next to the birds or something like that um, so it's a quick activity because like you guys know he is almost two so his attention span is not very long so something that's really quick and kind of gets the message across is what's best for him um, this is from the um, bundle that I got from Amanda at Faithfully Homemade. If I can find the um, individual, what's it called? The individual 
file for this, I will put it down below. Keep in mind all of these activities are laminated just so they'll peep better, um, but definitely not something that you need to do. Thursday's color, so I have this color wheel. I don't remember exactly where I got this from. I bet you can find one online. Um, and I just laminated this so it's nice and ready to go. And then I've been seeing these at Walmart, so I picked them up. And what he's going to do is match the clip to the color on the color wheel and clip them on until we have the full rainbow. So I highly suggest if you are planning on homeschooling and need some manipulatives, look at Walmart and see if you can find these because I think they would be really good to use. And finally is Friday. Um, we have these flashcards that once again I got from Faithfully Homemade. If I can find the um, download, I will put the link down below. Um, so it has different flashcards of animals. And so we have a bunch of little people that he got for Christmas. And a lot of these animals are in there. So whichever ones I do have, I'm going to take out and take these flashcards. And he's going to match the little people animal to the flashcard. So once again, something really quick that will keep his attention. Um, but he's learning from. So that is our activity for Friday, which is choice. Um, I opted to do this instead of um, a craft because, well, why not? Um, so that is our um, lesson plan for this week. Um, I'm hoping to do these videos every Sunday. This one's up a little late because I um, was kind of behind on getting stuff done. Lincoln's been very fussy, Sawyer's been very needy. So it is Monday when I'm finally getting this done. So I'm hoping to have these up every Sunday so you guys have an idea of what we're doing for the week. Um, if you have any questions, put them down below. Like I said, if I can find links for everything, I will put them down below so you can get your own. Um, otherwise, we will see you guys in the next video. Bye.